Carla, thank you. One day after UTEP announced the return of Keitha Adams, the Miners reintroduced her as the head coach of the UTEP women's basketball team this afternoon. That's right. Adams is still the all-time winningest coach in Miners history and had some pretty famous friends on hand for her uh, big return to El Paso, we'll say. KTSM 9 Sports Director Colin Deaver was at today's reintroductory press conference. And Colin, I imagine Keith still has that burning passion she was well known for when it comes to UTEP hoops. Yeah, it's it's still there. And she was even talking to Joe Golding. Uh, he was there, of course, on hand. Has a Red Bull machine in his office. She said, hey, if I need some energy, I'm going to go into your office and get one. And why wouldn't she? Multiple times today, she was reintroduced as UTEP. Uh, she was talked about how it was her second home. She'll get to work immediately. She's already meeting with players from the 2022-23 minors to gauge interest in returning to play for her next winter. It was a surprise to everyone that Adams was interested in returning to El Paso. Athletic Director Jim Center said that he thought she was joking when she told him that she would like to return. Her pedigree is fantastic. Two NCAA tournaments and two extended WNIT runs in 16 years at UTEP. She also coached some great players some of whom were on hand today to see her reintroduced. Leading the pack was WNBA star Kayla Thornton, who's happy Adams is back as well. I just am on this two home thing. I'm there and I'm here and I'm there and I'm here, but I have two homes and um, the opportunity to come back uh, really excited me and yeah, El Paso and UTEP has never left my heart. What she's going to bring is just going to be an actual, um, you know, what we, what she taught me, you know, and that's just, you know, being a dog and being competitive and just to get after things. Thornton could be seen talking to current UTEP players about Adams after the press conference in the transfer portal era. Having a WNBA player singing your praises as a coach, certainly not a bad thing. Adams said fans would like the coaching staff she's currently putting together. She was set to be paid $375,000 in the final year of her contract next season at Wichita State. UTEP will owe the Shockers a buyout payment of around $250,000 to bring her here. We do not yet know the full details of her contract to return to UTEP, but it is a six-year deal. More coverage throughout the evening on KTSM.